hello guys welcome back so in this video we'll be working on how to open your java file of a desktop application in design mode so this is very simple thing so here you have source and design but uh, this is related to guys who are trying to take the project from other place and trying to run that project in netbeans ide so in that case you may not see you will only see the java files here but uh, you you can't see this design mode or you can't open this java file in design mode so how to do is this wherever your project is for example my project is in uh, this path so i'm just going to take this path and i'm going to run this so so here is my path and source and this is my project group by type see you need to understand one thing in uh, netbeans for every java file a, de a designing java file you have a form for it and you might be confused why you don't have a form for this java U uh, youtube netbeans project so we'll go to our project pack and here this is a plain java file so here you can see there is no jframe or you can't see any design here okay so this is a plain java file but coming to this this is having few awt components into it uh, like text fields or some auto generated code into in this right so to run the java application view at faster way so in netbin there is a provision that for every java file there is a form file created to it so if i if i don't have this form files with me i can't open this form files a form and form 2.java in design mode okay so for a simple understanding i'll just cut this and i'll just paste it out of the project okay so here uh, in the form 2 so for form we have removed the form uh, form dot form and just for form 2 the form is available so we'll see how it works in netbeans now so i'm just going to click on this see you can see this has become a plain java file now without form okay so there is no design available here this has but for form 2 we have not removed the form file so that is the reason we can see the design here so we'll just undo this process again we'll see what happens i'll go back to my directory and i'll go back go a step behind so i'll just copy cut it and paste it in this as it is like before so a little bit confusion it might be creating for you guys that form dot form and form to dot form actually this is a simple a java file which i have created but i have named them as form and form 2 just ignore that you can make it anything whatever whatever the name here it has it will be same for the form also that will be created directly with the netbeans ide so let's back to the uh, thing what we're working so form and form has been added into it now we'll see what happens in the netbeans so i'm double i'll double click this so the design has come with your all preview so this is the, the best option in netbeans and the negative thing of this is if you don't have the form file of your java so that could be a little bit uh, it is very hard and it i have never tried in another ways but you can't open that in design mode so make sure whenever you are trying to add the java files make sure you have the form files of it to show that in design view okay so that's it guys thank you for watching